talk with Julian Le Peru who's going to wrap up another riding title uh, here at Keeneland. Uh, last time riding regularly here has to be sweet to, to go out with a title. Yeah, definitely. You know, uh, love to win the title over here and uh, just go out here. Last meet. Well, I'll be back, you know, uh, be back in Keeneland, obviously, but uh, full time for sure, last one. Uh, but it's great. Come back and, and uh, win the title here this year. It's great. What do you like about riding here as far as just the, the fans and the appreciation for racing? Well, that's what it is, you know. I love to be at Kenan and uh, see people every day. Uh, we got very lucky with the weather too this year, so, you know, the fans show up every day. Uh, and they're very nice, good racing. So, it's, it's just a, uh, all together, it's just a great place to be. You know? I want to talk to you about a, a chance to go out with a stakes win on the last day in the Elkhorn and a horse you're going to ride News Dad for Bill Mott. Uh, certainly seems to, to love this uh, these long distances. Yeah, he's been running very good at, at Gulfstream uh, this winter. Uh, it's a nice horse, you know, big, big strong horse, loves the distance. Uh, I think he's got definitely a great shot to win. Uh, as far as uh, running style, uh, is there something uh, way you preferred for the race to unfold for him, or is he pretty versatile? He's pretty versatile. I think uh, he's going to be on the lead or close to the pace anyway, uh, and he, he will come running for sure. Yeah. I know he's running on the, on the main track here. Has he been on the turf here? Uh, I'm not sure if he came on, a, on this turf yet. But uh, this winter, I mean, he's been running. What's great. been impressive about what he's been doing down at Gulfstream? Uh, what, what's caught your eye as far as being on him? Well, you know, uh, first race I rode him, I went on the lead. Uh, we got a very easy pace. We went very slow. But he finished the last quarter of a mile after uh, this long race in 22 inch change. So uh, he finished very strong. I know the turf over there is very hard and fast, but he did finish it very nice. And uh, he came back and went second in the state, beat by a nose, and then came back and win the stakes uh, at Gulfstream. So he's been running very good over there. And uh, hopefully he, love, he likes the track over here and uh, run as good. Yeah. Uh, we're getting a little rain now towards the end of the meet, uh, so soften up the course a little bit. Uh, mm -hmm. You talked about how well he ran on the firm. Does, does he have a preference, firm or soft? I think he'd be, he'd be fine. Uh, but I guess we got to see uh, how he goes uh, last day of the meet. Yeah. Good luck. Thank you.